the all-time rockers out there that love their classic rock and roll, you're going to love the next act. Good mate of mine, Marty Penrose, we caught up with him Australia Day 2013 out at Silk Road, and here's what he had to say. seen the big O, Roy Orbison, better known as my good friend, Mr. Martin Penrose. Welcome to the Tribute Show, Mark. Oh, thank you very much, Tony. That was very nice. Nice introduction. Thank you. And it's great to be here on the Tribute Show. Um, great to have you on board, Martin. The audience absolutely loved you. And I've got to say, mate, um, great to see you with a live band. It is great. And uh, the band's been together a long, long time. And uh, in fact, Trevor here has been involved since 1994. Long time. And... Uh, the bass player Gary, he was uh, in jail first, got out, joined the band after that, and uh, <laughs> he uh, kept going. And the, the show has been going a long time. And uh, back in the days in the 90s, there when the Beat Nicks and there were Credence and uh, a few old shows going around, and Baba came along. And uh, so this one's been going a while. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever you like, Martin. The floor is yours. <laughs> I'll take the glasses off. So. It's hard to see. I can't see you with these glasses on. So. Okay. Yeah, that's all right. Um, yeah, so anyway, so it's been going a long time and uh, we enjoy it. You know, Roy and uh, we actually had a show, Big old Elvis Spectacular, Roy and uh, Elvis. Roy started off first, uh, the Big O show. That was back in the um, early 90s. A guy called Rick Diamond, who's the father of all Roy Orbison impersonators. And still going around, Rick, he, he was fantastic and still is. And then uh, Tony uh, Boulder got involved after that. And uh, he was fantastic for about 10 years. I came in as the third Curly with the Three Stooges, more or less, and, and took over as Roy and, uh, and, uh, and Elvis, uh, um, Johnny Memphis got involved. And we uh, combined Elvis and Roy together and we did really well. Uh, in later years, we had a drummer join us. Uh, TJ, his name is, and uh, he's also got his own Michael Jackson show, so it sort of just keeps evolving into different things. So, it does, you've uh, got uh, Michael Jackson sitting to my right, and this beautiful young lady <laughs> behind me is your daughter. That is my daughter, yes. Uh, she, uh, she's the new addition, she uh, helped us out, um, there's a few people on holidays at the moment, so, uh, and did a good job, so yeah, she helped out, so yeah, it just keeps evolving, and it's a bit like that with the as a lot of the younger tribute shows, you know, we just heard a couple of great ones out there tonight. But in excess were fantastic, and Meatloaf, and you know, so there's been they're still kids, mm. so they're uh, they've got a future ahead of them. It's just we just hope the industry's there to to support them and, and get them the work. That's the Absolutely. main thing. And, and look, that's that's the big plus for the tribute show because it, it, it's 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 helping these acts sort of get some work, and 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 people around Australia are seeing them. So it's fantastic. Well, that's been the goal for us, Marty. We, we want to show Australia and New Zealand and the world what we have here in our country. And I think it's world class. Yeah. I mean, some of your high notes just then blew me out of the water. Yeah. I couldn't believe you were yeah. hitting those notes. You can't quite see it, but sometimes while Trevor's playing guitar, he sticks his finger just at the back of my backside, just okay. the back there, just the right time. But that's only on stage. I don't know why he did that to me off stage, but that's another story. Fantastic. Yeah. Well, two quick questions, Martin, before yeah. we go to a break. Uh, number one. Where's your next show going to be? Uh, well, we've actually got a show uh, on the 23rd of March. Uh, it's a reunion show for this particular band, and uh, we'll be putting everyone back together again. So uh, you can go to martypenrose.com and see the gig list for all that sort of stuff. Uh, we've actually got the next show is actually in Kentucky, in the in the state. So I got that in February. So uh, that'll be interesting to see how we go over there. as a Sun Legend sort of tribute going on over there. So so that'll be terrific. And uh, after that, we're looking to morph into something else. We, we're like a lot of the the bands and the tribute shows going around you've got to be versatile and everything else so we're looking to morph into something a bit uh, a bit uh, different and uh, try and get a bit more work 
Well, that second question, do you find me attractive? <laughs> Just thought I'd throw it in, folks. Uh, only when you're here, when, only when you wear your hair to the left. to the team and everyone else out there on Australia Day 2013 and to those other artists that did appear on that event you will be telecast throughout the course of this season and that brings us unfortunately to the end of another episode of the tribute show we're going to leave you at this